Carpet, the Nashville Film Festival, presented by Nissan. Cannot quit laughing at this guy, who we're so happy to have back in his hometown. Not with, In at. Nashville. At. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're, we're having a lot of laughs. See, he's a funny man. Richard Spate Jr., everybody. Hi. Hi. So, you're here. Welcome back Thank to you. Nashville. Thank you. Which is Great. home territory. It is. I'm on my home turf. Your home turf. And this is very exciting because you have a short film in the festival this year. I do. This is. I've been here before just to hang around as a lurker, but this is my first time to be here with an actual film. But, I mean, you're a superstar, so lurking kind of does not apply. Not a good choice of word here, just hanging out. Superstars can't lurk? Yes, you I, You probably, yeah, can't well, do that. No, but I, we're really excited. America 101 America is the, 101. the project, a yeah. short film. It is. So tell us a little bit about the project. Okay, America, America 101 is a, a short film. It's one man's twisted tour through his own personal version of the American experience. It's a socially satirical dark comedy. And it stars Rick Gomez, with whom I did Band of Brothers. So I, Rick and I have been buddies since the Band of Brothers days, but we haven't worked together since then, so it was really fun to team up with him. And yeah, have a friend be in on the, exactly. in, in yeah. on the action. Put too. him through the paces. So Aha. <laughs> what do you think it is about, you know, we're seeing a, a sort of a lot of films that have this little slice of American pie, just a little bit of Americana, and the comedy element, why does that resonate with audiences so well now, you think? You know, I feel like sometimes you're going to tell a story that, that might have a a social bent or a political bent, something like that, it's very easy to get heavy-handed and beat people over the head, which nobody likes. No. That's not fun. Uh, I think the advent of, you know, Jon Stewart and, and Stephen Colbert and people of the, of the like who have been able to take socially topical, uh, you know, uh, stories and make them entertaining, it sort of inspired a, a new wave of, of telling stories in a fun and, and unique way, but that actually have content that, that matters. Thank <laughs> you.